goes wide to Jones. They start to build off halfback here. Inside 50 is really nice. So the transition of the ball, great. Picks it up, Papley, and then just sits a high one up. And there are numbers here for the Swannies. Ground level, Parker. Gets a handball back to Big Sinclair. They've got their second. Parker on cue as Richard and Lingy sing his praises. Grundy flicked the little handball over the top to Jones. Gary Rowan was Downfield. intended target downfield. So this is going to be three in a row. Lead from Franklin coming. And you will honour that every time. Beautiful ball, Gary Rowan. Perfect kick. And they are all at sea at the moment, the Saints. Inside 50 they go again. Here's Heaney. Oh, they're lovely hands. Okay, Callum. They're getting a Jack, contested right footy smashing here. Oh, the Saints from a side who are as good at it as any in the comp. Look at Joey Kennedy go to work. Out to Papley. Left foot snap. It is raining goals. And seven unanswered goals. Early stages of this match is just really hard work. But his second, third grab. Oh, it's going to get worse here. This is a car crash at the moment for St Kilda. It's just a little bit too easy, that transition. No real pressure. And again, he's been able to just link up a handball. Kennedy stubbed his toe, it looked like. No problems because, well, this is just not good enough. Zach Jones, all the time in the world. That is nine straight to the Swans. Wow. Savage, inside 50 ball, it carries memory. Lloyd and Gresham at the back. Speculative handball back to memory. Memory squaring ball just works. Handball from Loney to Sebros. And just got to sit a high one up and hope. Rampy with a big fist. Sinclair, left foot ball, is going to bounce. Oregon has gone through. Well then he honours Big Patty, and that's nice work. That is what you have to bring, because as a team they have in this second quarter, and they're fighting it out in much better style. Franklin one-on-one, -on -one. that was always going to end that way. You do not want that situation, and Bud was too good. Here's Bud. Has he got the wheels? Instead of that, he goes in search of Haywood. Oh, there's an impressive young boy. Play on. Parker just to Yours. sit it inside 50. Rowan, big fly. Unable to get his hands on it. Heaney read it beautifully to Kennedy. Kennedy's low ball, brilliant to Papley. Over the top. Haywood will kick another one. Parker, great poise and composure, and it found a way miraculously. To Cunningham, Franklin's a chance, looks left, looks right. They come at him, he steps around one, clever little pass. Oh, what about that? This is Ed Phillips. And they've got a man at the back, his memory runs onto the footy. Oh, no, there was a Saints teammate in battle with 30 metres of space. And the Swans defence did it again. I think it was Grundy with his mother. McVeigh normally uses it beautifully. He goes to Gary Rowan. The ball gets to the back and Rowan can use his wheels. Look at the slicing run of Gary Rowan. Straightens up, kicks a goal. Although Cunningham wants to dish it off. I'm sure that was the right option. There might be a front contact here for Sydney. Papley to run around and snap a very clever goal. Seb Ross, high ball forward, Lloyd gets eased out of it by Steele, handball off to Mav Weller, can have a flying ping out of Mav and he's hit that pretty well. Rather formally referring to Buddy as Lance, you don't hear that very often. <laughs> that ball's kicked straight into the hands of Isaac Heaney and he goes low and firm inside 50 and Rowan was taken out of it illegally. 100 gamer now. You have a go after the siren and a set shot. To make it a 75-point three-quarter time lead, and he's got it. Membry worked his way through. 
Loney did nicely to spin out of it, then he was wrapped up in a wrong tackle. Florin around the body, Sinclair's got it. Has three on the night. Wants to sit it out in front of Buddy Franklin, and why not? Yours. This is Dunstan Ford. That's a good contested mark, Tim Membry. To Phillips, to Savage. Look out, Buddy tracking him down. High inside, 50 ball. That's going to work. And Jade Gresham ends up with the footy. Just a recap, Nathan Brown out of the game after half time with concussion. We were focused on Dane Rampey's courage and spectacular dismount there, but unfortunately, Nathan Brown copped an elbow in that collision as well. And you can see there, really groggy. Cunningham able to take an eternity to deliver that ball to Parker, and his hands are superb. Luke Parker, he wanted to play on. Play on. Dunstan's followed up, and he's going to look for battle again. Went back. And Easily fist away from Hewitt. Here he goes again. Loads up. Left foot to the goal square. And Josh Battle kicks his second goal of the night. Now Lloyd can walk through. More time and space than he knew. And missed. And there's the siren. 71 points in the end for the Sydney Swans.